Good day, gentlemen. We are going on a ride today. First ride in three months. It is January, what's the date today? January 15th today. And we finally have a break in our cold weather. And it is gorgeous out here. Oh, so nice. Such a great break from what we've been having. Got the Razor. Got some other guys out here that have come riding with us before. So it's going to be a gorgeous day. We are in the uh, West Nisbet Forest. Most of my videos are on the east side. And actually, that's where I've done the majority of my riding this year is on the east side. I'd hope to get to the west side, but uh, just never worked out, so get to do it now. The west side has a little bit different terrain than the east side. It's a lot more flat, uh, don't have access to the river. So that's one of the reasons why I like to go on the east side. Looks like winch has got a little bit dirty on the way. Razor started really nicely this morning. I was a little bit worried about how it would do with this uh, these colder temperatures. Just to give you an example, we literally had like minus 40. I know a lot of the guys that watch these videos, you guys are from the States, so you're minus 40 and our minus 40, they're the same from what I understand. So riding has just not been an option for a while here. So it's nice to finally get back out. I told my wife, I said, as soon as it's nice out, I've got to get back out on the, on the trails. And today is that day. One of the uh, comments I get from people sometimes on my videos is, you know, when they see me going through the, the deep mud and stuff like that, they go, oh man, like, you just wreck your machine when you do that. Like, why would you wreck such a nice machine? You know, I look over this machine, I don't see that I've wrecked it. I'm not exactly sure what those guys are talking about when they, uh, when they say stuff like that. Has some scuffs on it, yeah. Got some, you know, plastic gets a little bit scuffed from scraping branches and stuff like that, but... She's a uh, nice condition still. Back off without a wrap. Let's do it. No problem. Okay, so we're gonna head to the lobster cabin first of all. And we'll just go from there, so. Everybody good? All right. All right, finally hitting the trail. I don't know what time it is. Dang clock is blinking. No idea, but that's okay. It's a fun time of year to go because things really change in the winter. Nice thing is that you can pretty much go wherever you want. There's lots of swamps and sloughs throughout the forest. And uh, winter, obviously, they're all frozen over so we can get to wherever we want. Yeah, there's Lobstick Lake. Oh, and here's some sled trails. Well, maybe let's just head out in the lake. Oh, she's kicking up snow. <laughs> oh, winter riding rocks. I love it. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, two wheel drive. What am I doing? I can barely go in two wheel drive. We'll drive off! Whoa. Whoa. 
<laughs> oh man. <laughs> He's letting his daughter drive. That's cool. Okay, four wheel drift time. Oh, man. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. I'm guessing that uh, any other time of year, this is probably knee high mud and swamp. Ooh, look at that little trail. Going up that hill. Oh, how cool is that? I've never seen that before. Wow, and this one's somewhat complete, so I bet you this one hasn't been raped like a lot of the cars that we find in the forest here. A Hudson. Wow. That is so cool. Huh. Yeah. Tell me this, how did this car make it here? Well, look at this. What we got here? No, that's not the engine for this. Way too small. That's an old pump engine or something like that. Straight six? No, straight eight. <laughs> no, it's a straight seven. <laughs> one, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, okay, no, it is six. Huh. Okay, so no, that, that one's different. So it is a Hudson Serbia. Wow. Made in Canada. Really? There's a, a Ford Explorer in another part of the forest that everybody knows of that one. Okay. But I don't know how many people know about this. You're an you're a, you're a YouTube star now. Do you want to say something to YouTube? No, I say something. There you go. <laughs> I bet you this car, I bet you it's not even accessible in any other time of year. It's a humongous swamp here and trees all around there. It's a Hudson Serbia. Never heard of it. So this forest has a bunch of what are called cabins. And uh, we're on our way to Lobstick Lake, which has uh, Lobster cabin, and uh, I'm not exactly sure what the history are of these cabins. Somebody built them, and a lot of them are quite well, were quite nice. Oh man, but people have definitely not treated them well over the years. It becomes a place for people to party, and then oh, we need firewood. Oh, let's just peel it off the walls. But. Uh, we found our way into a lobster cabin. Finally found a trail that looked right. And so tight though for a side by side. And there's the cabin. Look at that, it even has its name on it, lobster cabin. It's a historical cabin. So we could stay in here if they really wanted to. We'd at least give you a little bit of shelter. Not like there's any windows, but you could actually sleep on here. Boy, those are short. Made for kids, I guess. Somebody stole the stove probably a long time ago. Ow! 
It's made for very short people.